you've ever grown potatoes, you probably have gone to your nursery in early spring, almost late winter actually, and bought you some seed potatoes. That's traditionally how we grow potatoes, is from small little potatoes like this that have the eyes that begin to sprout. And we typically just plant these straight into the ground around mid-March. So I always say St. Patrick's Day, when you're starting to think about Irish and, and that sort of stuff, that's the time to plant your potatoes. Now, if you have something larger, you typically will cut those up a little bit and allow them to cure. Now, this is how we usually think of growing potatoes is from something like this that's called a seed potato. But today we're gonna to do something a little different, and that is because we have an AAS winner that's called a Clancy Potato Hybrid. And this, we actually got true seeds from a potato plant. And so you can see these seeds, they are pelletized, so they're a little bit easier to handle, but these are true potato seeds. Now, just like any other plant, potatoes do produce seeds. In fact, after they put up that flower, they will produce a fruit that looks very similar to a tomato. And that's because they're in the same family, the nightshade family or the solanaceae family. Now, you never want to eat the fruit off of a potato plant because it can lead to some serious health problems because they have some toxins in them. You can eat tomatoes, obviously, but not the fruit of a potato plant. These seeds come from that fruit of the potato plant. And we're gonna actually plant these today. Typically, we don't do this. We just use seed potatoes because they come back as genetic clones of the mother plant. But this is a new hybrid that has blue flowers. Um, and it will produce a red, kind of a rosy cream colored potato tuber. So today we're planting 12 seeds that will produce potato plants for us. A lot of times we don't grow potatoes from seeds because sometimes it can take a little bit longer to grow them from seed versus from a seed potato. The other thing is a lot of times we never see the fruit actually being produced on a potato plant. That's because after they flower, a lot of times those flowers will just drop off of the plant. Usually in cooler climates where we have cool, longer days is when we will see the fruit actually being produced by the potato plant, which is nothing like our Oklahoma summers, obviously. So this is kind of a novelty, but a lot of people will probably still be growing the old fashioned way with their seed potatoes. But if you want to try a true potato seed, look at the Clancy Hybrid. Hope you enjoyed this video. It's part of our Oklahoma Gardening YouTube channel. You can also find even more videos on our OK Gardening Classics YouTube channel. And join us on social media for great gardening tips, photos, and discussions.